ஹாய் ஹலோ வணக்கம் அண்ட் வெல்கம் டு த ஃபஸ்ட் ஸ்டெப் அகாடமி லேர் அண்ட் க்ரோ எஜுகேஷன் மீடியம் ஓகே த கிவன் ப்ராப்ளம் இஸ் சிம்பிளிஃபை பி ஸ்கொயர் ப்ளஸ் த்ரீ பி மைனஸ் டுவெண்ட்டி எயிட் பை பி ஸ்கொயர் ப்ளஸ் ஃபோர் பி ப்ளஸ் ஃபோர் டிவைட் பை பி ஸ்கொயர் மைனஸ் ஃபார்ட்டி நைன் பை பி ஸ்கொயர் So we need to simplify this problem. So look at here we have division as operation operator. So we need to convert this division into multiplication hence we can do bit easier. So by con when we are converting from division to multiplication hence the particular term will become reciprocal. So reciprocal in the means as I said 1 divided by the particular term. So in this manner this term when i'm converting from division to multiplication the numerator will become denominator and denominator will become numerator for example if a divided by b is there in the sense if the reciprocal of a by b is 1 by a by b now look at this b further will come to the numerator am i right so b by a so reciprocal of a by b can be written as b by a in that manner if i take the reciprocal of this so numerator will become denominator and denominator will become numerator so i'm going to rewrite this problem now along with the operation called multiplication so b squared plus 3b minus 28 divided by b squared plus 4b plus 4 into b squared minus 5b minus 14 divided by b squared minus 49 right fine now look at we have uh, this is 5b right right we have uh, three polynomials we are going to factorize all the all these three polynomials and we are going to find the respective factors and we need to substitute in the respective places right and also look at this denominator term it is b squared minus 49 right so 49 can be written as 7 squared am i right 7 into 7 is 49 hence i'm going to rewrite this as b squared plus 3b minus 28 divided by b squared plus 4b plus 4 into b squared minus 5b minus 14 divided by b squared minus 7 squared right so it is look at this form this is in the form called a squared minus b squared am i right a squared minus b squared hence we can write it that as a plus b into a minus b where here a is equal to b where b is equal to 7 am i right fine let us substitute uh, this value here bit later meantime let us factorize all these polynomials right fine i'm taking this polynomial 1 and this as polynomial 2 and this as polynomial 3 hence i'm going to factorize it now so look at so polynomial 1 so b squared plus 3b minus 28 look at the constant term it is 28 so when i'm multiplying two numbers that should provide minus 28 am i right it is minus 28 so minus 28 if i add those two number that should provide plus 3 right so already we know that 7 4 are 28 but look at when we multiply these two number that should provide minus 28 hence one of the number will become minus but when i add these two number should provide plus 3 hence plus 7 and minus 4 are the numbers right so 7 4 are 20 7 plus 7 minus 4 is plus 3 right so i am going to split up this 3b Uh, according to this so b squared minus 4b plus 7b minus 28 hence now look at these two terms b is common so i'm taking outside so b minus 4 remains here in these two terms 7 is common so i'm taking outside so b minus 4 remains in these two terms b minus 4 is common hence remaining is b plus 7 these are the factors of polynomial 1 right next i am going to factorize the polynomial 2 the second polynomial is b squared plus 4b plus 4 look at it's a simple one right 
when I multiply that should provide plus 4 when I add also that should provide plus 4 hence plus 2 and plus 2 right so b squared plus 2b plus 2b plus 4 look at these two terms take outside b as a common one so remaining b plus 2 here 2 is common remaining b plus 2 so here b plus 2 b plus 2 is common hence b plus 2 I am taking outside rest of things is b plus 2 right these are the factors of polynomial 2 correct let's let us factorize third polynomial that is b squared minus 5b minus 14 right so when i factorize this so look at when i'm multiplying two numbers that should provide minus 14 at the same time when i add that should provide minus 5 obviously it is minus 7 and plus 2 minus 7 into 2 is minus 14 and minus 7 plus 2 is minus 5 am i right look since b squared this 5b can be split up as b squared plus 2b and minus 7b minus 14 right now look at these two terms b is common i'm taking outside so b plus 2 where in these two terms minus 7 is common so i'm taking outside the remaining value is b plus 2 right so look at these two b plus 2 is common i'm taking outside so remaining b minus 7 these are the factors of polynomial 3 now substitute all these factors in the respective places also apply the formula called a squared minus b squared in this denominator hence how can we write in place of b squared minus 7 squared we can write as b plus 7 and b minus 7 am i right so substitute all these value into this expression now right so when i am substituting so first polynomial the factor is b minus 4 into b plus 7 divided by the polynomial 2 is b plus 2 into b plus 2 into the third polynomial is b plus 2 into b minus 7 divided by where the formula we applied over here through which b plus 7 into b minus 7 7 now look at the parameters look at these factors so the possible uh, things can be cancelled very easily now so look at b plus 2 b plus 2 will cancel and b plus 7 b plus 7 cancel and finally b minus 7 and b minus 7 will cancel the rest of the value is b minus 4 divided by b plus 2 and this is answer for this particular problem right this is answer for this particular problem hope you understand how we solved for uh, how we found answer for this particular problem so once again i'm reading the problem and answer so the problem is b simplify b squared plus 3b minus 28 divided by b squared plus 4b plus 4 divided by b squared minus 49 divided by b squared minus 5b minus 14 so the answer is b plus 4 divided by sorry b minus 4 divided by b plus 2 the answer is b minus 4 divided by b plus 2 hope you understand this may be useful to you thank you very much this is your the first up academy learn and grow education video